I know everyone is on the down with Intel bandwagon right now, but you should probably go over and check this article out. It's written by John. He's with Puget Systems, and they build computer systems for a living, and we're talking about PCs, high-end, as well as custom workstations, and all the rest of it. So to sum this very detailed article up, and make sure you go check it out, basically, as many AMD processors fail as Intel processors. Over the years, all different generations, all things considered. So, you know, maybe Intel really messed up, um, you know, with this 14th and uh, 13th gen processors. And, uh, you know, hopefully this microcode fix, which they will be releasing in a few days, I hope, in the middle of August, will you know address this concern and maybe they can i think they're going to offer an extended warranty on these processors and maybe they can make the rma process simpler and this is an interesting graph right here because it shows the r5000 the 7000 as well as the intel 10th 11th 12th 13th and 14th gen processor failures overall and if you notice look at the 11th gen <laughs> man you think the 13th and 14th gen processors have issues the 11th gen well that wasn't maybe a total catastrophe but it was it was pretty pretty bad